Did you know that 80% of our daily decisions are made using shallow thinking? Then is that always a bad thing? Let's dive into why both shallow and deep thinking are essential for managing your tasks and mastering your personal knowledge management PKM system. Paperless movement, your productivity, your way. In today's fast-paced world, we rely heavily on two types of thinking, shallow thinking and deep thinking. Some people swear by quick surface level thinking to handle the constant barrage of information. Others argue that true understanding only comes from deeper, more thoughtful analysis. So which is better? The challenge lies in balancing these two modes of thinking. Shallow thinking is what helps us keep up with the rapid flow of information. Meeting notes, quick decisions, urgent tasks. But if you stay in this mode too long, you might find yourself overwhelmed with a backlog of unprocessed thoughts and tasks. On the flip side, deep thinking requires time, focus and energy. It's where learning, creativity and true problem solving happen. But it's not always practical for handling the fast paced demands of daily life. So how do you manage both effectively? Shallow thinking gets a bad rap because of its name, but it's crucial for staying organized and efficient. By using tools that promote tagging, categorization or even AI to streamline information retrieval, you can quickly capture and retrieve essential data without getting bogged down. Steve Jobs once said, you have to work hard to get your thinking clean to make it simple. Shallow thinking is that simple thinking, allowing you to keep moving, stay on top of small decisions and avoid information overload. On the other hand, deep thinking is where the magic happens. It's the mode we switch to when we want to deeply understand concepts, solve complex problems or develop new ideas. Visualization is key here, allowing you to see connections, organize thoughts and make abstract ideas more tangible. But visualization needs to be paired with writing. Writing down your thoughts helps cement your understanding and turns big ideas into actionable steps. Here's the key insight. The real power comes from knowing when to engage in shallow thinking versus deep thinking. Busy professionals need to learn the shift between these modes. Use shallow thinking to keep up with daily tasks and quick decisions, but carve out time for deep thinking when you need to analyze, create or solve bigger problems. Knowing the difference can help reduce mental overload and improve focus. By distinguishing between shallow and deep thinking, you can manage your mental processes more effectively. Shallow thinking keeps you organized in the moment, while deep thinking helps you uncover deeper insights and solve more complex challenges. Both are essential to mastering your PKM system. So what type of thinking do you rely on most? Let me know in the comments below. Are you more a shallow thinker or deep thinker and how do you balance both? Let's keep the conversation going. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel so I can catch you up next time.